Alright, what's up guys? Back with another video. It's me, Jordan, the Pharaoh, with Nisi. My girlfriend. And today is a little mix-up video. I'm basically finna interview her, see what she thinks about relationship and about us. You ready? I don't like questions like that. What I'm just gonna throw that out there. Yeah, I'm gonna throw it out there. Don't even warn me. Mm -mm. So you could be fresh, you know. I didn't tell you no questions and I just got them on my phone. You ready? You know, it's just some simple questions, right? Ready? What would be your idea of a romantic vacation? Mm -hmm. For a vacation, who would you want me to take you? I don't know. To take you? Yeah. I like anything. As long as you come up with an idea. Without me having to say, Oh, let's do this. This will be nice. Like with the picnic. I had to come up with that. You know? I'm talking about vacation, not like no date, but a vacation. Same thing. Okay, okay. Okay, and vacation wise, as long as we're going from Texas, that's all I know. Okay. I don't want to be here. Okay, it's okay. It's okay. Okay. Shoot. Okay, okay, okay. Get a little tougher. But you know what I mean? Yeah, I think. Mean. Okay. What's the single most important thing for a relationship to be successful? What's the key for a successful relationship? Communication. Oh, good. Really? Mm -hmm. Explain. Because you. Me. Damn, I think it's about me. Continue. Yeah, just communication. Okay, let's bring up some things from the past. What wow. was your first impression of me? You was tall. <laughs> That's the first thing you thought? Yeah. I was like, damn, this nigga tall. Yeah. Like in theater, we was standing in the hallway. He's tall. Is that, that the reason why you liked me? No, he was tall. He was chocolate. He was chocolate. I'm chocolate, mm -hmm. so I'm dark. Skin He's dark. Is he darker than me? Who oh, darker? Maybe you. Because you ain't had your parents, baby. Sure. He had a peanut head. He did have my little peanut head. He was cute and tall. Nah, I'd be. He was cute and tall. Anyways. Okay. If there's one thing you'd want to change about me, what would it be? Anything. 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 The way you bend your fingers. I'm just kidding. I'm about to show. Not, show. not get the fingers. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Um, I'll say when you can't make up your mind. You never make up your mind. When I can't make up my mind? Yeah. Because all you say is, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I want you to be more open and choose. I just don't be like, choosing. Nah, that goes. Like, I like to have your opinion. My opinion? Yes, yeah, sometimes. Sometimes? Yes. Yeah. So not all the time? Not all the time. But sometimes, sometimes you want my opinion. When I ask you. Okay. But let me ask you this. If we hadn't met each other, what would you think you would be doing right now? Or where do you think you would be at in life right now? Watching Netflix in my room, bored. No friends. I'm just kidding. I'll probably still be friends with Candace. Talking with Candace, you know. I'm not a party type, so I probably changed from being a party type person. Probably King Trump. Mm -hmm. I'm just no, no, yeah, you know. Yeah, I probably would have been a party person. Party person. Yeah. What is one thing I do that pisses you off? Like that really just makes you mad. That makes you want to just hit me or oh, it's just like or no, to like serious though. But it's something that I do that just pisses you off. When you do that, it's something with your 
It's oh. that noise. I can't. Like uh, oh. when, you, when you're trying to get mucus out your throat. Yes, that. <laughs> that. Like I really just want to punch in your throat to make you stop. Really? Like you think I'd be laughing like would you, but I'd really be angry. That's why I'll start sitting there quietly after you're done. I'm just quiet sometimes. But if you can give me a funny nickname based on my personality or some part of me, what would it be? Something with your ankles. Oh, my ankles. Good. <laughs> your ankles. No, don't be talking about my ankles. Good. So your nickname? I can't think of a nickname with funny name right now. But it probably go based with on my your, ankles. Yeah, it will be based on your ankles. Because mm. mm -hmm. you know how you can't, you don't like um, high top shoes or anything? Yeah. Because of your ankles. You know. Because every time you take off shoes, you think about your ankles. You got all my ankles on the right and that. <laughs> the way it is. It'll be your ankles. Okay. A, a relationship question. Why do you think some couples end up cheating on each other. Um, probably not giving enough attention. Why should I don't give you attention? Go always on the case. As if I be cheating on you or something. Nigga. I'm playing. I'm playing. I'm playing. Yeah. Probably not, not enough attention. Attention. They don't want to hurt them, you know? I feel you. Like, they don't want to be like, oh, I'm going to leave you and just jump right into another relationship. Speaking of that, I'm going to holler at you. <laughs> what you mean? Mm -hmm. You about to go right here and lay down. <laughs> okay, what is the most special memory of us that you hold? For me, it just happened. I made too much for me. You know how that go. <laughs> Do you think confessions make a relationship stronger? Like, say you did something, you just confess. Does that does that build a relationship or break it down? I feel like it depending on what it's it a hard is. question. Yeah, that is a hard question. I give an example of confessions uh, for either breaking or building. It could be either way though. Okay, say if I confess to you that three years ago I kissed another girl while we were together. That's, um, I thought you said, oh, is it like the beginning of our relationship? It was, say, freshman year. 
relationship. I'm not saying. No, not the beginning of a relationship. Not freshman year. No. We already made our like six years and stuff. Yeah, right like we, we are right now. I'm just saying, like, what if I told you right now, freshman year, I kissed another girl when we was together? I'll be angry, even though it's in the past. But, like, would you break up with me? Or no, what? I wouldn't break up with you. Uh, well, one I'm just playing. <laughs> I'm just playing. You just better not do it again. Like, the trust, your trust level will go down. It'll go down? Yeah. Okay, so what if I told you? No, since we're just a kiss, but if you have sex with another girl, I wouldn't talk to you for a little bit, you know? Okay, so say freshman year I had sex with another girl. Or we was together. Yeah, I wouldn't talk to you for a while. Oh, and then I'll actually be like, okay, it was like a one night stand. Was it through the night? I was hoping for a week straight. Oh, then we done. Oh, really? Yeah, we done. A week straight, we done. <laughs> <laughs> Not straight, but like four out of seven days. No, we're done. You kept doing it, doing it, doing oh, it. Yeah. I can understand the one night scene. Not that I really can't understand that, but. <laughs> but still. Yeah. What's the craziest thing you'd be willing to do for me? Example wise. Like, I'm asking you. Can't, like, think like if someone had a gun in my head, it'd be like, Where is Grace? Shoot me. Girl, this ain't Grace now. If I had a gun in my head and someone pointed at me, and then someone said, Do something crazy, what would be the first thing you'd do to save my life? What do you want to do? Suck your toes or something? <laughs> <laughs> I hate toes. You do that? Yes. <laughs> you suck a random nigga toes to save my toe. life. Suck your toe. What do you want me to do? That was your answer. <laughs> like, what's the craziest thing you'd be willing to do for me? You suck another man's toes. Suck your toes. To save my life. Yep. Yep. What if we got like the gout? <laughs> Stop. I already hate toes. No. Right. Ew. <laughs> what <was> you do? <laughs> just flick your shoe off. <laughs> um, that I sock can't remember mine. You were just gonna have to die, okay? I was, wow. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I was gonna suck his toes, okay? Wow. That's nasty. <laughs> I'm gonna have to bleach my mouth and everything. Yeah. Can I kiss you for a week? So you gonna kiss me. <laughs> I may be alive, but I ain't kiss me. <laughs> you gonna kiss me. Alright, last one. Ugh. I lost it. Okay, this is this is a little this is a deep one. Mm. When do you think a person is ready for marriage? Well, I want to be married before. Oh, okay. hey. continue. No, continue. Uh, and somebody's ready. Okay. No. First think. answer. When do you? What age do you want to get married? Like twenty six. By twenty six. Okay. And what age? And in what time do you think someone is the perfect time to get married? Cause when they got their stuff straight, like they got their own house or apartment. You know, good job. That's what I call. Mm -hmm. okay. I, I wanted you to go in depth into it. I don't know, like, you just staring like, okay, she off track, but okay. Go ahead. And that's it. Yeah. When everybody got their life together. And yeah, they both got good jobs. Good jobs. Ain't no records, no drinking. You know, now I'm just saying stuff right now. Because we don't do that. We don't do what we do, but not like, we're just straight alcoholics, you know? Mm -hmm. Not partying a lot. And I always want to be with their friends all the time. Have guys in my room. Well, could just be couples then. We always got that. Yeah. They like say it like. Yeah. All right. Thank you for watching the yeah. video. If you enjoyed, give it a like. And some of these questions, answer them yourself. You know, just me interviewing my girlfriend. I'm gonna interview you. Huh. Mm -hmm. Anyways, drop a like, comment below, subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you next time.